is my tutorial for a western style snow globe cold cup. I have been addicted to the Southern Belle foils and transfers lately and with the cold cup season around the corner I wanted a quick yet unique way to decorate a couple for my upcoming RTS event and Southern Belle glitters foils is absolutely perfect for that. For the snow globe portion, I'll be using Annabelle glitter from PDB and a touch of metallic mint micas from Woody's Goodies. To help keep the glitter from clumping up and getting stuck in the cold cup, I'm gonna alternate adding the glitter with the liquid. I absolutely love these cups from the Stainless Steel Depot because they come with the hole already in the bottom and I'm lazy, I used to hate doing the little hole in the bottom, using the drill or the hot fix tool, either one, it was just a pain. And they also come with these little plastic plugs that are removable until you seal the bottom. This will let me add the liquid, seal with the little plastic plug, and then I can decorate the tumbler. Then I can remove the plastic piece and let it sit for a little bit to let the bubbles rise to the top. Normally you add the liquid and then you have to let it sit for a while, then seal it, then decorate. So it's a nifty little feature to have a pre-drilled hole with the little plug thingies. Now that my snow globe is looking good, it's time to play with some foils. I'll be using the Southern Bell foil glue as per usual. I love it. You could probably use Tacket also if you don't have the foil glue, but Tacket, mm, if you can get the foil glue, get it. I'm gonna use a paintbrush to apply. There's like a little plastic indentation or lip right here on the tumbler. That's where I'll be starting my glue. For some depth, I'll be applying a few layers and I'll be starting with the Arizona foils, then the gilded foils, and then the Arizona foils one more time on top. I like to apply a full base layer of foils, then for the second layer, apply the glue just in spots instead of full coverage so the base foils can still be seen.
Okay, so now that I've added the Arizona foils, now the gilded foils, now I'm going in with a small paintbrush and just adding the glue in spots one more time and then I'll be reapplying the Arizona foils again on top. Now to do the same thing on the top that I just did on the bottom. And I'm going to be just decorating the top and bottom of the cold cup so the snow globe feature can be seen in the middle, but you can make yours however you like. Have fun with it. Okay y'all, this design was screaming sunflowers. Add some sunflowers. <laughs> so I have some cute ones from Mr. Nola's glitter that I'll be adding, but as always, you don't have to. This design is super cute as is. Now that I'm all done decorating, I'm going to remove the plug on the bottom of the tumbler and just let it sit so the bubbles can kind of rise to the top. 
Now, I used to let my cup sit overnight, but then I saw this technique called, I think it's called degassing, something like that. If you guys know what it is, let me know in the comments. But I saw a cup maker take some 91% alcohol, put it in a syringe, and then squirt it in the bottom of the tumbler, and all of the bubbles that were still kind of in there disappeared. It was amazing. It was, it's exactly like if you have like a spray bottle of alcohol and you spray it on your epoxy and all the bubbles pop, exact same thing happened. It was awesome. And when all those bubbles popped, I had more room to add more liquid. And so I did. And now when I lift up my tumbler, that bubble, that's going to be, you're going to have a bubble, but it's going to be super small instead of huge. Like some of my cups used to be when I first started. Ready to seal the bottom, I'll be using UV resin from CC DIY and mixing in Annabelle from PDB. I'll be curing it under my UV light for about two minutes or so. To check it, I would just touch the bottom. If it was still sticky, I'd let it sit a little longer under the light. After it was done curing, I decided to add a couple more sunflowers. I just neglected to film it. Sorry about that, y'all. I sealed my foils with quick coat from CC DIY. If you don't, the epoxy will repel on the foil. So be sure to seal your foils first with a, either quick coat or clear sealer. Now I'm sealing everything in with epoxy. I'm gonna be adding a touch of sparkle with Hudson from Southern Belle Glitter, as well as a touch more Annabelle from PDB, which you can skip that if you like, but it's, it's extra glitter y'all. It's pretty, so do it, do it. <music> till smooth and then you'll be all done that's it guys thank you so much for watching my tutorial a huge thank you to all of my mentorship and channel members your support is literally everything have fun experimenting with your own cold cup designs and i'll see you again next time